in a few days time we're going to be heading out on another bikepacking adventure this time we're going to be riding in the Yorkshire Dales a midge hell this morning I bet Paul's not putting any sun cream on right, we've done all that downhill and now we've got a six mile climb <laughs> so Paul on a scale of I love my bike to it's going on eBay where are you right now see this you want a bike like this I hate to give up but it's the historic centre of Wensleydale even need to have a rest going downhill on this stuff. I said, should we get him one? And Andy said, no, uh, sod him. Go on then, clear off. We've got these got ready. And you can carry on being Cheers. mean after the video Cheers. goes off. Cheers. Cheers. Morning. You were snoring like literally 10 seconds ago. Morning. Yeah. I kept waking up in a cold dread last night. Almost all packed up. So we're just getting ready to set off on day three of the tour of the Yorkshire Dales. Today is 36 miles back to where we parked the car near Settle. 3,500 feet of climbing and it's going to be 28 degrees today so it's going to be pretty tough. So what are you doing today Paul? I'm ditching the planned ride and going on the road. Still 30 miles and still about 2,000, just under 3,000 feet of climbing I think but I think it's the safe, safest option for me. Yesterday I was pretty sure I was going to give up, but I decided I'll feel worse having given up than I'm actually going to feel on the climbs today, so sticking with it. Good luck, Paul. Hope it's harder than our ride. <laughs> Oh, is he in the way? Yeah. In, it, your mate's in the way. Get out of the way. He's always in the way. So Andy says this first climb is hike a bike. And if he's saying that, goodness knows what it's going to be like. It's only 10 o'clock in the morning, or I don't know, thereabouts. And it's already baking hot. So begins a mile of hike a bike. That is truly awful brutal so hot we've got about another 40 feet to climb i can see the top right there finally and then look at that down there where we've come from 10 feet climbing to go and it's pretty much straight up that last bit was a little bit steep when i just come around the corner and saw that i thought I is that a joke Mountain biking territory, not really gravel bike territory at all. Don't mind getting a bit wet. So hot. So How do you hot. feel about gravel biking now? Hate it. Look at that. It says Tara. Just leaving this village. Look at that over there. That's where we're going to go over, I think. There we go. Climb number two of four. Look at that. Got about 82 more feet of this climb to do. Really steep though now. These cows are enormous. And that is it. We're at the top. So what do you reckon? We've done 12 miles, 24 to go, so 
a third of the way there now. But I reckon by the time we've gone down this hill, we'll be halfway. Halfway by lunch time, and a litre and a half water drunk. How do you feel about this track now? Mountain bike territory again, except the one mountain biker fell off. Now this is pretty stunning. Just not too much fun on the gravel bike. So I've got 21 and a half miles to go. If we're on mountain bikes with no bags, we'd be flying down here so quick it'd just be a blur. It's so slow on these. Welcome to hell. I think that must be Kettlewell that we're heading down into. Hopefully get on top up on water and maybe even have lunch. Until then, loads more of this to do though. Yeah, I had a couple of near misses on there. Yeah, I did, to be honest. Even on that. Goodbye, Kettlewell. Thanks for the Wensleydale. Excellent sandwich. Here we go. <clears throat> off road. And another climb. And it goes off road now. Although it doesn't look too bad. Looks like a nice track. Well. We've done 20 miles, we've got 16 to go, so well over halfway now. And on what I think is probably the last significant climb. Well, if you like this video and you've made it this far, click the like button below. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, click the subscribe button below. And finally, if you want to get notified by YouTube about the next video, Click the notify icon as well. Well, I think I see the hiker bike section up ahead. But that is the top at least. And I think we stay pretty much up high for quite a while before going downhill back to the campsite. That's the climb so far. And that's what's left of it. Andy up there walking. That is a beast. I thought I could do it, but I'd... it's too hot. Yep. Too hot, too tired, too late. Yep. It looks like miles. Yeah. Let me look down there. Now then cows, you're going to have to move. I think the heat strike must be getting to me, I'm seeing a mirage of road, tarmac up ahead. I must be seeing things. Straight back off the tarmac. Now this is civilised gravel. Nine and a half miles to go.
Well, last climb, about five and a half miles to go. Nearly at the top of the last climb now. I've done in. It's so unbelievably hot. I know I keep saying that, but this is the hottest I've ever been riding in. Unbelievable. my calves and my hands cramp up. I thought I was going to have an off on that because I hit it at speed. How'd you find that then? Uh, well it's tough, I mean you're just on the brakes like this yeah. and then my, my calves are burning. Paul got back to the campsite about 10 to 1 and it's now what, 4.30? 4.30. Yeah, so he's been probably lazing in the sun, sleeping. Oh, all the way up. No pedaling. Three miles to go. We've succeeded. Two miles to go. One mile to go. Sean right there. Andy just in front. Finishing together. Heading into Ostwick right now. Half a mile to go. Sean, we've done it. Time to start racing then. No, you don't do a pull. I've been waiting for you. What do we think? Brilliant. Very hard. It was tough, yeah. Very, very hard. But we've done it. Success. Oh. Yeah, wrong bike. Very hot. Good camping, good fun. And we win, according to the Garmin. We win. There he is. Oh. Waiting for us. How was yours? It was fantastic. Was it? Honestly. Really? It was. It. Brilliant scenery. Yeah. Brilliant ride. Near four hours. Yeah.